Small look how big the crap. Same pair three for the whole tour. Trap on in the iPhone four. Still got do all my old chores. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm GOA back with another new video. So in this video, I am gonna be showing you top life hacks for PS Touch. So, without wasting time, let's get started. So the first is, PSDX. If you want your friend, to make changes in your project, and you want to send the whole, project with layer, then you can send, through PSDX file. So first you have to click on share button, and click on share, and then change the, format to PSDX. You have to download ES file explorer, and afterwards select, save to ease file, and then select desired directory and click on select. Now just open ES File Explorer, and open directory where you saved your project, and click on it, it will redirect you to Peace Touch, in this way you can send file to your friends. Now the second is, create folder. By clicking on the three line, you can create new folder, the benefit of creating folder, it helps you to find project faster. So as you can see this, I had many folder, on different stuff like, banner, thumbnail, text style, etc. Third, auto recovery. So let's imagine that, you are working for one hour in a project, on PS Touch, and you, forgot to save, and your phone crashed. So after opening the piece touch, all the work is lost, so to fix that, auto recovery is used. So first of, click on, menu button, and click on general, and scroll down, and click on auto recovery, and enable it. It will help you, to recover the unsaved project. Fourth, gallery instead of photo library. Sometimes, the image in the photo library doesn't shows up, so it confuse us, to fix, that we can use, our gallery, as media browser. Click on the menu button, and click on image import and, enable native, photo browser. So as you can see this, when you click on photo library, our gallery opens, and we, can select any photo easily. So guys if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button, and subscribe for, more videos. Thanks for watching.